Listen to your preferred news feeds with Audiogo.com. Shocking collapse of world economy warned is underway. A grim report just issued by the finance ministry that is circulating in the Kremlin today says the United States clearinghouse interbank payment system CHIPS has ground to a virtual halt signaling that a major global economic collapse is currently underway and could very well likely enter into the dreaded freefall zone. Virtually unknown to all but the global financial elite, CHIPS is the main privately held clearinghouse for large value transactions in the United States settling well over $1 trillion a day in around 250,000 interbank payments that together with the Fed Wire Fund Service, which is operated by the Federal Reserve Banks, forms the primary U.S. network for large-value domestic and international U.S. dollar payments where it has a market share of around 96 percent. The cause underlying the collapse of chips, this report says, is due to the unprecedented demand for immediate liquidity relief being sought by the largest banks in the US and EU that are being crushed under of the combined debt of both the United States and Europe said to total near $39 trillion. Important to note is that what is currently happening is a virtual repeat of the 2008 financial crisis that the United States Senate's Levin Coburn report found was not a natural disaster, but the result of high-risk, complex financial products undisclosed conflicts of interest, and the failure of regulators, the credit rating agencies, and the market itself to rein in the excesses of Wall Street. Grimly echoing this ministry report is the latest data see chart second photo, or click on link from the Baltic Dry Index BDI that is a number issued daily by the London-based Baltic Exchange and shows it in freefall dropping 65% in the past 30 days alone a terrifying amount of loss not seen since the dark days of late 2008. Not restricted to Baltic Sea countries, the BDI tracks worldwide international shipping prices of various dry bulk cargoes that has collapsed so severely global shipping has all but ceased thus leaving our world's largest transport ships anchored and empty off the coast of Singapore photo third right in what is described as the biggest and most secretive gathering of ships in maritime history whose numbers are equivalent to the entire British and American navies combined. During the 2008 financial crisis an outright global economic catastrophe was only averted after the U.S. Federal Reserve secretly gave out to U.S. banks and corporations, and foreign banks everywhere from France to Scotland, over $16 trillion that was only discovered due to an amendment to the Dodd-Frank Wall Street Reform and Consumer Protection Act passed by the American Congress that called for their being audited for the first time in their 99-year history. Note. To place that $16 trillion into perspective, remember that the gross domestic product GDP of the United States is only $14.12 trillion, and the entire national debt of the United States government spanning its 200-plus year history is only $14.5 trillion. Curiously, the aforementioned amendment to the Dodd-Frank law only called only for a one-time audit of any emergency lending facility established by the Federal Reserve since December 1, 2007 and ending with the date of enactment of the law when it was signed by President Obama on July 21, 2010 thus keeping hidden from the American people who is getting their money. To if anyone in the world, even the powerful U.S. Federal Reserve, has the power to avert this coming catastrophe, this ministry report warns, it is unlikely due to the cascading collapse of the global derivative market due to the mounting gridlock in liquidity that U.S. billionaire and Obama confidant Warren Buffet warned back in 2003 were financial weapons of mass destruction. Though the word derivative sounds complicated and technical, understanding them is really not that hard. A derivative is essentially a fancy way of saying that a bet has been made. Originally, these bets were designed to hedge risk. But today the derivatives market has mushroomed into a mountain of speculation unlike anything the world has ever seen before. Estimates of the notional value of the worldwide derivatives market go from $600 trillion all the way up to $1.4 quadrillion. $1.4 quadrillion is roughly, minus 40 times the world's stock market. Minus 10 times the value of every stock and every bond on the planet. Minus 23 times world GDP. Failing to be noticed by the Western peoples about this global economic collapse is that it has been, in all probability, a planned event due to occur so as to initiate a new world order that has long been sought after by the elites, 
but was condemned by the ancients who warned that the uniting of our world as an economic dictatorship would lead to every human being having to obtain the mark of the beast thus bringing this present age to its end. In a Western world devoid of morality, and lacking the knowledge of the ancients, it is beyond doubt that this coming economic collapse will take them by complete surprise as the last one did as they have been trained like dutiful slaves to only adhere to those voices leading them to their doom. But for those who know the truth, the time is nearing an end for preparing it will come much sooner than anyone will believe. Source Related Posts <laughs>